To move your music library to an external drive on a Mac, first, navigate to the Finder menu in the top left of your desktop and select Preferences from the dropdown. In the window that appears, make sure the External Disks box is checked under the General tab. This ensures that your external hard drive will be visible on the desktop. If you don't see your external drive on the desktop, then you may need to format it for Mac. This is an easy process and I've linked a tutorial and my recommended external drives in the description. Then select the sidebar tab and check the box to the left of Music in the Favorites section. Exit out of the window and then launch Finder from the dock. Click on Music in the Finder sidebar and then click on the folder labeled Music in the right column. Here you will see a folder labeled Media. This is the default folder that contains all of your music stored locally on your computer and it is accessed from the music application. Then double click on your external drive icon to open the contents in a new window. If it's a new drive, you won't see anything in the window yet. Next, click, drag, and drop the media folder into the external drive window and wait for the contents to copy. This can take some time if you have a lot of music and you may need to pause this video for a while. Once the media folder has finished copying to the external, click and drag the original media folder to the trash. I don't recommend emptying the trash yet. Then, exit out of both windows and launch the music application. Once music opens, navigate to the music menu in the top left and select Preferences from the dropdown. In the window that appears, select the Files tab and you will see the current path to your media folder, which is still pointing to the old location. Click the Change button to the right, select your external drive from the column in the left, and then click on your media folder. With the media folder selected, click Open in the lower right of the window. You will now see the path to your media has been updated to the folder on your external. Then click OK in the lower right and the music application will update and relink your media. If you get a prompt during this process, click Yes and it will finish updating. At this point, you can go ahead and empty the trash by clicking and holding on the trash can icon in your dock and selecting Empty Trash from the menu that appears. Click Empty Trash again in the prompt and you're all set. The music application is now reading from the media folder on your external drive. Any music you add in the future will also be added to the external instead of the old location. Just be sure to have your external drive connected before launching the music application. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to my channel and please leave a comment if you have any questions. Thanks.